What's up everybody, it's Tech Maxim here, and today we got a new video on how to install Pertainer to manage all your docking containers. It makes it easier and way better. This is mine, like my main instance that I run on my main server, everything I got on there. I manage everything with Pertainer. So let's get into the video, man. Login, SSH into it, so it's uh, at uh, 0.96, I believe. Oh yeah, log into that. Should let me log in. Oh, I made it turn it wrong. Even turn it wrong. I'm misclicking. Hold on, give me a second. There we go. So if, when you have like a new server, you always want to do this. Let's do sudo update. Enter your password. It only acts once. You want to update it. And then you want to do sudo apt upgrade dash y let's do that i'll be back when it's done okay now that it's done we're going to install docker so use the commands that i'm going to put in the description below first you want to enter this one uh let me just do this real quick All right, now that's done. Do the next command. Let me just copy it. Now that's done. Do this. Then sudo apt update. I'm hitting everything but the one I need to press. Now I'm going to enter the sudo. You just copy the command. I'm just going to type it. Oops. <clears throat> so I'll be back when it's done installing. It may take a while depending on how fast your server is. This is a VM, so it might not be that fast. So let's just clear this out. Let's see. Uh, I believe it's Docker version. Yeah, it is. All right. So we've got Docker installed. So now we're going to install Pertainer. Excuse me. Oh, but what you want to do is Docker volume. We got to do sudo Docker volume. Create. Do Pertainer. Underscore data. Now we've done that. What we're going to do into this command that's like in the description below. And we're just going to go all the way to the back and press sudo. I mean, add sudo. It's going to pull it and let it do its magic. I'll be back when it's done. And now it should be done. So we're just going to do sudo docker ps. It's going to show that it's running. So what you want to do with the server, you can go to your server's IP address. So let me, I believe, IP config. I forgot they removed that uh, IP dash A, is it? I don't remember the command they should they remove I use Ubuntu 20.04. But uh yeah. You want to find the IP address you use to log in, so go to a browser. Now what you gonna do into the IP address of your server. This is mine. Enter the port number 9443. Make sure it's HTTPS and then enter the IP address and then this port. So you want to put the semicolon or colon, I forgot what it was, but 9443, and then you want to click advanced, proceed. And it's gonna log you in. You gotta make a username, so I'm just gonna make this tutorial. I'm not going to use this. This is a VM, so it's just put a password that's secure. Oh, I got to be solved. Let me just hold on. Let me make a longer password. All right. So now that we have our Docker container, we just got to proceed. So, you know, just environments, all that local. You just go here, click local. Of the environment and now we're done so uh yeah go to uh i'm looking for 
Go home. Go to local. Load a local. See the container we got running is pertainer.